dear children from this video i'm going to discuss about the dichotomous keys dichotomous keys ki anne debedum suchiya dichotomous key dichotomous key is the categorization of organisms based on presence or absence of a characteristic feature මොකක් හරි විශේෂිත ලක්ෂණයක් characteristic feature එකක් තියනවද නැද්ද presence or absence යන දේ පදනම් කරගෙන සතුන්ව කාණ්ඩ කරන එකට තමයි categorize කරන එකට තමයි dichotomous key එකක් නැත්නම් දෙබෙදුම් සුචියක් කියලා කියන්නේ the point we have to remember is that we only use only the external features of the given organisms deela thiyena jeevinge bahira lakshana padanam karagena external features bahira lakshana padanam karagena thamai api dichotomous key ekak kandinne now let's see an example okay children now let's classify the given four animals parrot dog earthworm and crow You know, when drawing a dichotomous key, we consider only the external features. No, ogolo dhanno duwe pute. Apni debe dum suchiyak. Eh manatta dichotomous key ek ka use karanne. Bahira angal akshana vitarai. Apni ta sattunge bahini inda ka ganne pulwal akshana vitarai. Okay, tell me a characteristic that we can use to classify the given four animals into two groups. මේ දීලා තියෙන සත්තු හතර දෙනාව group දෙකකට අපි ඉස්සරලාම කඩමු we use only the external features i categorize the above four animals based on the presence or absence of legs මම දැන් හදන්නේ මේ හතර දෙනාව පාද සහිත සහ පාද රහිත විදිහට කොටස් දෙකකට කඩන්න ඔගොල්ලෝ දන්නවනේ අපි ඩයිකොටමස් කී එකක් අඳින්නේ මොකක් හරි කැරැක්ටරිස්ටික් එකක් මොකක් හරි ලක්ෂණයක් තියනවද නැද්ද කියන එක අනුවනේ with legs පාද සහිත and without legs පාද රහිත with legs කියන එකට කවුද අයිති වෙන්නේ පාද සහිත සත්තු තුන්දෙනෙක් ඉන්නවා මෙතනනේ parrot dog and crow parrot dog crow and the animal without legs is earthworm gadawil panuwa earthworm now we found a specific characteristic for the earthworm onna den api earthworm wa wen karagatta now there are three animals remaining no sattu tun denek kituru vela innawa let's find a characteristic that we can categorize the three animals into two groups balanna me sattu tun dena diha parrot dog and crow two are birds and one is a omnivorous animal parrot dog and crow now we can classify the given three animals into two groups as with wings and without wings piyapat sahita saha piyapat rahita vidihata apita me gollamwa wen karanna puluwan neda okay let's do it with wings and without wings tell me the animals with wings out of these three parrot and crow have wings no with wings parrot and crow and the remaining animal without wings is dog 
nature of the beak you know parrot has a curved beak no giravata tiyenawa wakuta vichi hotak okay let's categorize the two birds according to with a curved beak and without a curved beak api den e denawa wakutu hotak sahita saha rahita vidihata kotas dekakata wen karagam with a curved beak and without a curved beak tell me what is the animal with a curved beak wakutu hotak tiyenne kaata da parrot neda parrot the animal without a curved beak is crow understood okay now see we categorized the given four animals according to their specific characteristics so children the only thing we have to remember when drawing a dichotomous key is that we use only the external features of the given animals api sattunge බාහිර අංග ලක්ෂණ විතරමයි ඩයිකොටමස් කී එකක යූස් කරන්නේ අන්ඩර්ස්ටුඩ් 